Peppa Pig Magic Mirrors. There is a new mirror in Peppa and George's bathroom. George thinks there's another little pig in the room. <laughs> Who is that? That's George again. I know. Who is that? That's a, a Peppa again. This is a mummy pig again. That's right. They're all silly again. <laughs> That's right. You can see yourself in them because they are so shiny. This gives Peppa an idea. <coughs> oh, are you okay? Come on, George. She says, "Let's go and look for other shiny things." Peppa and George find the Daddy Pig downstairs. We are looking for shiny things to see ourselves in," says Peppa. "Why don't you look in these spoons?" suggests Daddy Pig. Daddy Pig gives Peppa and George a spoon each. They can see their faces in the spoon. My face looks funny," says Peppa. "Look. Now turn the spoon around," says Daddy Pig. <gasps> "I'm upside down," cries Peppa. "How does that work, Daddy?" "It's simple," says Daddy Pig. "Concave surfaces reflect light waves inversely to their origin." Peppa looks confused. "Is it magic?" asks Peppa. "Yes," replies Daddy Pig.、Mm, "It's magic." Peppa and George search for more shiny things. They meet Susie Sheep outside. Look, Susie says Peppa, showing Susie her spoon. I can make you turn upside down. Well, how does it work? asks Susie. Magic replies Peppa. Peppa, Susie, and George look for more magic things in the garden. They find a big muddy puddle. I can see the sky says Susie. Just then, Pedro Pony and Danny Dog arrive. Did you drop something in the puddle? asks Pedro. No, we are looking at our reflections, just like a mirror, says Peppa. I know where there are some real funny mirrors, says Danny. The children head to the fair. Roll up, roll up, cries Miss Rabbit. Come and see my wobbly mirrors. Wobbly and silly. Wobbly silly. Everyone goes inside Miss Rabbit's tent. Peppa and Susie look at their reflections in a funny-shaped mirror. What's happened to my body? asks Peppa, giggling at their wobbly reflection. Look, this is wobbly. Danny is looking in a different mirror. His face and body look very wide in this one. I've gone all squishy, says Danny. Is Danny becoming squishy? Yes. Oh my goodness! Look at George. George has found a mirror that makes him look huge. Roar! Says George. He thinks he's as big as a dinosaur. Pedro's mirror is strangest of all. Look at my neck! Says Pedro. It's as long as Garrett giraffe's. <laughs> long necks. Why do you look different in each mirror, Daddy? Asks Peppa. It's very simple," says Daddy Pig. "Illusions of optical differential、uh, differentials,、uh, differentials,、uh, differentials. Yes, by convex. Everyone looks a bit confused. So it's magic," says Susie. Daddy Pig smiles. "Yes, it's magic," he replies. Outside the tent, Mummy Rabbit has brought her twins, Rosie and Robbie, to、Where、see their you... aunt, Miss Rabbit. Who is Rosie? <laughs> yeah, who is Rosie and Robbie? I don't know which one is which. <laughs> Hello, sister says, "Mummy Rabbit, how are you?" "I'm very good, sister," replies Miss Rabbit. Daddy Pig and all the children come out of the tent. It was amazing there," says Danny. "Daddy Pig, and the mirror out here is amazing too. I can see two of you. <laughs> That's Miss mean... Rabbit. Miss Rabbit. <laughs> That's right, Mama Rabbit and Miss Rabbit." Silly daddy says, "Peppa, it's Miss Rabbit and the Mummy Rabbit. We don't need a mirror," says Miss Rabbit, "because we look so alike." Well, we are sisters," says Miss Rabbit, "and the Mummy Rabbit together." Hee <laughs> hee. The end.